Lavender Hill Loft. Brewer's yeast is one of the easiest and cheapest items that we can give our birds. It has a wide variety of benefits. One is primary that it gives bee complex to our pigeons. It will put a beautiful sheen on their feathers. It makes their eyes sparkle. A lot of um, people who raise fancy pigeons for showing use lots of vitamin B uh, through bee resist. It's a good product. It has a whole host of wonderful, wonderful benefits. It's easy to administer. It's a little tricky. Um, and I think a lot of people kind of get um, frustrated with it. But I want to show you the way I do it, which is really easy. As you can see, I have Vitaking Brewer's Yeast. It's no better than any other Brewer's Yeast that I've ever had. I, in fact, I used to live next to a home brewer, uh, micro brewer and I would get their um, dried yeast on a regular basis and I found it to be just as good as Vitaking or Natural or any other. Um, get yourself a bowl um, such as this that's deep, that's easily cleaned. I like to administer my Brewer's yeast on my feed um, with olive oil. Um, some people use canola or corn or peanut oil. Um, all of those are just as good. If I had my choice, I'd use peanut oil, but I I don't right now for whatever reason. I just have olive oil, which is good. Um, what you're going to want to do is take your feed of choice. Mine's just my breeding mix. And I'm going to take just a little bit of oil, not much. A little bit of oil goes a long way here. And just put a little dollop in. Big spoon. Some people use their fingers. And just get that. around well you want to make sure that all the grains are coated and you can see how shiny the grain is it's kind of sticking together sticks on the spoon that's exactly what you're going for then you just take your Buer's yeast a little bit of this goes a long way you don't need much and I just sprinkle it like garlic oil. See how it just dusted everything? And you just turn that in. And you just turn it in. And what happens is, is the viewer's yeast binds with the oil, sticks to the grain, and you can see it barely sticks to the spoon anymore. That's because it's all bound together. Now, some people would give this straight away to their birds. I don't. I like to let it set, oh, five, ten minutes um, with oil. If I'm using lemon juice, I'll let that set longer because the grain actually will expand a bit. Um, and the birds will feel like they're getting more food than they actually are so I like to let when I use lemon juice to let that sit overnight but that's how I administer Buer's yeast to my pigeon feed Lavender Hill Loft Washington DC